segmental rolling is initiated by looking in the direction of travel and then sweeping either the lower or upper extremity in the direction of desired travel. The head and upper extremity travel as a unit, engaging the entire front line or back line. As you can see, each segment of the vertebra should rotate independently in a smooth, sinuous motion. The leg should come off the ground at the very last moment. Faults include rotating the whole body as a unit or using the legs to compensate for insufficient upper extremity flexion or extension. This results in a jerky, clumsy roll. To activate the lower extremities, we'll reach up towards the ceiling and then across the body, always looking in the direction of travel or preferably where the limb will be placed. Faults include turning as a log or using the shoulders and hands to execute the movement.